Gemini, what's up G? Welcome to my channel, am I tripping or not tarot? My name is Cockfrost, but you can call me the ghetto nun. So Jimmy, I'm here to do your August slash general slash love reading, my G. I do cuss in my readings and give no fucks about it, so if you do, please get the fuck on. Let me fix this, Gemini. Uh, I do start all of my cards upright in my deck. I don't believe in starting out with reversals because that's some bullshit. Also, I did pre-shuffle Jimmy, but I did not lay any cards down just yet. We're going to do it together. Please keep in mind this may or may not resonate with every single Gemini. Again, no fit nuts. Info for private readings will be below the video. Please take the time to check out our community board. It's like the farmer's market for all the nuns and high priests where they have their businesses, purposes, gifts, etc., etc. posted. If you'd like to submit your business for the bulletin board, please check the info in the description box below the video, but it is currently under construction. If you find that the convent is not for you, please look for the nearest exit mark. Get the fuck on. Watch your head on the way out. Hit the alley. You'll be back in Thailand. Thank you to everyone for all the bookings, donations, likes, subscribes, comments, shares, purchases to my website, and pledges to my Patreon. I love you. Jimmy, thank you for being a... Uh, I know I said it in the bonus, but still, again, thank you for being the second highest viewed video after Libra for July. Uh, normally, you would have got the first video, but Libra got the in the first section. Nothing with all of that, but I just wanted to say thank you, uh, Jenny, okay? Gemini. Hmm. I don't really know what's going on with you, Gemini. Do you know what's going on with you? They told me to ask you, do you know what's going on with you? Because I picked up on Scorpio energy, like the uh, intuitive message I got for them. But it's almost like then it got scratched, like stopped the record, record scratch. Like, right? It just stopped, like right in the middle of your intuitive message. So I don't know. Maybe, uh, Gemini, you may feel like you were in love with somebody and now you're not. Or you may have felt a certain way about someone, someplace, something. Or they felt somebody else felt this way about you and now they don't. It feels like something like just like the record stop, like literally, like, like it's for real. I don't know. You may have a record player and a record scratch. Somebody could be a DJ. Uh, Gemini, I don't know. That was odd. Like literally I was all prepared. Like, okay, I'm ready for Jimmy's message. Cause I don't get my intuitive messages until I start the reading. They don't give them. Sometimes they give them to me prior, but that's usually for collective, but for individual like, uh, Zodiacs, they usually give them to me. Like at when I push record, that's when they start. So as soon as they were getting started, like the music, the record just stopped. The music stopped, the record stopped. So I don't know what that has to do with you, Gemini. Maybe somebody feels like somebody was trying to control them. Like they felt like they were doing something and not for them, but for somebody else or because of something else. And it wasn't really because they wanted to do it or because they wanted to be there. Or maybe you felt this way. It's like almost like somebody snapped out of some shit. Damn, Jimmy. I don't know, Wooski. Okay. That kind of cut your intuitive shit kind of show. Let's see. Give me some messages for Gemini. Shit, what's going on? Maybe something just happened, Gemini. Oh, okay. So maybe as I'm recording this or as you're listening to this, but I'm picking up on energy, but probably as you're listening to this, Gemini, or uh, right before you listen to this or shortly after, something will have changed about the way you feel about someone, someplace, something, or this is somebody else. It's like, you know, like a... Uh, changing your mind when you get to the drive through Like, I thought I wanted, you know how, like, uh, Taco Bell and Kentucky Fried Chicken mixed together, right? It's kind of, I know it's a fucked up ass, uh, analogy, but that's what they said. It's like, got your mouth all set for some KFC, but then when you pull in the drive through you're like, oh, shit, I forgot they got the T-Bell, too. You know what I mean? Like, damn, okay, I think I want Taco Bell. It's just, like, that quick, like, from KFC to Taco Bell, G. I don't know, y'all need to stop eating that shit if you are Gemini, but... That's pretty much what I heard. Give me some messages for Jimmy. What do they need to know for August, damn it? What's going on with him now? What's going, uh, going on with Jim and I here? Okay. Damn. So this is, uh, usually this is sweeping out negative energy when it's upright. This shit came out reverse, Jim and I, meaning like there's something you may still be holding on to or something someone else may be still holding on to, but it's negative. And then you got the stamp reverse. This is crazy because now the stamp is reverse, which suggests that you're not holding on to it. This is weird. It could just it came out like that and be like, I swept out the shit, right? But it came out, I didn't sweep out the shit. Okay, but now I'm done with the shit. I don't know what this means, Gemini. Okay, you could be a Taurus Gemini cusper just all confused in this motherfucker or somebody confusing you because this is like my uh, kind of hierophant kind of car because of the planes, but it's reversed. Something's, someone's getting unstuck from some negative. Oh, okay. Someone's getting unstuck from some negative energy here or someone that is negative is what this is, Gemini. You or somebody else. 
definitely could be a, a Taurus or this could be somebody that you're married to or someone that you uh, are in a committed relationship with. I mean, shit, a job with that five there, that 32, even though it's upside down, but still, right? This is somebody who feels like it's a negative environment and they don't want to fuck with that shit. So this could be you feeling like this. Like, I don't want to be stuck in this negative ass shit. So maybe somebody just, you know how it is, Jimmy. If you anything like the nun skin, you probably are because you're in the convent. When you walk up in your job and you don't think, you just think it's going to be another day, but this is the day you actually quit, but you didn't know you were going to quit. You know, you just had enough. <laughs> it's like this shit. If you anything like me, like, you didn't plan on quitting this day. It's like I came in with my sandwich, uh, my lunch, I made my breakfast and everything. You know, it's like I was ready for another shitty day at this punk ass job. And then just something happened. You're like, fuck this. And you just quit. Like, literally, that's why I said something feels like it just automatically was like, mm, never mind. This could be you feeling this way about someone, Gemini, or maybe someone feels this way about you. I don't know. Damn. Somebody may uh, go missing from the military. What do they call that shit? AWOL or some shit? Uh, somebody is just missing, G, or just decides not to show up, come back to work, come back home, Gemini, something like that. They just leave, G. This is get between me, Satan, <laughs> right? Because, you know, I got to get the behind me, Satan, and the train is between the chair legs. So I don't know. Somebody could not that you say, you, well, shit, it could be Gemini. Like, you know what I mean? Some, like, uh, entity, some evil shit, some demonic whatever the fuck, negative-ass person could be trying to get between you and someone else, something else, or someplace else. Like, something is smack dab in the middle making something hard. Uh, that's why Satan is between your legs. It's, oh, Gemini. No, you did it. What does that mean, Jimmy? It's not Satan, it's between your legs. Is that a song? <laughs> what the fuck? That's what it, because they reminded me of, uh, for those who are True Blood fans, when uh, Jason went to the damn Christian camp and that girl got on stage and sung that song talking about Jesus took me out last night, right? That was the name of the song she said. I'll never forget it because I thought that shit was so funny. Talking about how Jesus took her out on a date. But this is the devil between your legs. So I don't know what's going on. Something about a, a crazy Christian camp that's not Christian or a cult or some shit like that where the words are different. I don't know, Gemini. What is, are you watching something on the A&E channel? Possibly. This like this That sound like you or some old weird ass shit you stumbled upon and shit. Like, why are you watching this, Gemini? Okay. Put one on not sweeping out negative energy. Or you know what this is, Gemini, too? Somebody's been trying to cleanse out some negative energy and they haven't been able to do it, but it's because they live with it, work with it, eat with it, sleep with it. It's something like that. Uh, that's why they can't do it. It's like you live with it. You know what I mean? How you gonna clear out something that you, you gotta move or it gotta move? Put some on uh, the negative, okay. Signs. I saw the signs. Yeah, that open ace of base. I don't know. Uh, somebody's house could be going up for sale, though. That's usually what this is. Well, I mean, I just got the damn cards, but when this comes out, it's giving me for sale sign. Like, this could be a house getting floor, foreclosed on. I don't know. Something about the floor. But this house could be getting foreclosed on, or just you could be selling a home. You could be into real estate, Gemini. Maybe you don't like it anymore. It's like the industry all fucked up, or it's just negative and shit. You know what I mean? And I don't want to do this shit no more and shit. Like, I'm getting the signs. Maybe people, you, I don't know. Some of y'all Gemini could be, like, involved in, like, some industry. You don't have to be real estate. But it could be something where, like, uh, the next generation is coming in and you see the signs. You know what I mean? Like, that's about my time to go. You know, like, you know, this type of shit. Or the neighborhood could be changing or a relationship or something like that. It could definitely be a neighborhood changing. Oh, who got security? Ooh. Somebody's getting escorted out, Gemini. Or somebody's calling an Uber to come get their shit. Somebody getting told to get the fuck on, Gemini, is what this feels like. Out of a house. Somebody could be getting evicted, though, too. Like, that could be an eviction notice on somebody's door and shit, you know? And they won't leave, but they're going to leave. Somebody who refuses to leave is going to leave, Gemini, okay? That's probably the sheriff in them, okay? Somebody damn sure going to go, Okay? Oh, wait, not they setting fires. This could be with a fire sign. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. I got a uh, Taurus out here or a Taurus, Gemini, Cusper, or is you, Gemini, acting a whole fucking plum fool out here, okay? Somebody done lost their damn mind. Oh, wow. Okay. Put something on the damn stuck now. 
the wild hyenas. Look at that shit. Fires, it came out anyway. Mm -hmm. I don't know who this is you kick it with, Gemini. <clears throat> This is giving me three and Scar is there too. This ain't no good, okay? Somebody hanging out with some bad people. There's a ringleader and a group of like followers. I told you it was some crazy ass. I don't know if it's a Christian camp or what, okay? I told you it was some weird ass campsite. Uh, this is giving me Charles Manson shit too, like like cult and shit. Uh, some type of shit like that, Gemini. I don't know. Maybe somebody didn't know that's what it was. Maybe it looked nice on the outside. You know what I mean? Like, oh, this looks like a pretty good church. You know, till you get up in this shit or some group or job or relationship and somebody was just like reaping like all type of, I don't know what the fuck was going on. It feel like hell, G, like just bad shit was just happening to somebody. Like, you know, you got fires and it's like someone saw the signs. Like, you know, when you smell smoke, when you see smoke, there's definitely a fire. So someone got a sign that there was, I smell smoke, right? I don't know, some mystical shit was happening, okay? Something, some weird shit was happening while somebody was with somebody. And they probably was into that witchy poo shit. That's the way it's making me feel. Like coat coven, like the craft without the good one. You know what I mean? This is the three before the, the one came to the school type shit. You know? Like this type of shit. Mm -hmm. Somebody want to leave a group? This could be a singing group, a family. Like I said, church, a home. It's giving, if this is a relationship, Gemini, there's multiple people in this relationship. It, it could be like a uh, sister wife and sister husband or brother husbands and shit, but it kind of feels like someone's married or with someone and the whole family involved in the shit. It's like this the husband or the wife or you the husband and the wife. This could be somebody, mama and the sibling. It's like a whole family or a whole group involved in your business, Gemini. Or you are. And somebody wants to remove themselves from this shit because bad shit been happening ever since they got involved in whatever this motherfucking malarkey is, Gemini. Okay? I don't know if you the one wanting to separate. It's like can't put a fire out is what this is. Not being able to put out a fire. It's like bad shit just keep happening or shit just keep crumbling, fucking up. Somebody getting badass karma with somebody. Uh, hanging around someone or hanging out in some place. I feel like someone's uh, not going to let all they shit burn right this is like some of your shit burn it's like well i'm gonna try to save something so it's like let me get out of this shit before i lose every fucking thing says you with somebody else gemini they can tell like this is no blame out here it's just not it's not so i know somebody does put out a fire though like an actual physical fire uh it doesn't stick which is good so i don't know that's good it doesn't spread i guess is what they're saying Ooh, we Gemini, what the fuck y'all got? What y'all cooking? <laughs> shit. Uh, this like this could be a wood pit, a fire pit, or some shit like that. Just make sure you pay attention. I see somebody putting logs or wood in a fire, and I don't know why it don't stay in the fire. It's like something hops out. It could be an amber or a coal. Something pops out of a something, Gemini. Okay, and it may catch. So be careful. Don't leave no nothing unattended. Chicken, uh, ribs, uh, fish, whatever. I don't know what you cooking. Shit. Just don't leave it unattended, G. You burn something, Gemini, and that is you, okay? I don't give a fuck what nobody say. Geminis are not the best cooks. I don't care what nobody say. I love y'all. I do. But y'all are not the best cooks, G, okay, at all. This this definitely sounds like you. But it's not, it's not even that you're not a good cook. I take that back, Gemini. Y'all be trying to do a, a, a gang of things at the same time. Like, while you're doing that. Like, y'all don't meal prep or food prep or nothing. Y'all just start everything like Julia Childs. First, you get the bird, right? All this shit at one time. And it's like, you should have chopped up the bell pepper and the onion last night, Gemini. So now that you're trying to chop up onion and bell pepper, right? You got steak sizzling over here. You making rice here. Tea over here. Something burning. Do you smell that, <laughs> Gemini? Or cross watcher. Okay? Somebody's just not a good cook out here, Gemini. Shit. Okay? Side note. Or in August, they ain't. Maybe you're like, we just go out. Maybe we should just grill. That's what this is. Maybe somebody's too hot to cook, Gemini. It could be that. To turn the oven on or stand in front of the stove or something. I don't know why they're going on about your food, but we have been eating good around here. I don't have Gemini in my chart, but I know you. we can because uh, you eat. Shit, we eat around here. Put something on the signs here with the uh, not sweeping out negative energy. Two of cups. Yep. It's somebody you connected to, Gemini, that's got some negative ass energy or some juju on them, a curse on them or something. And I rarely talk about that, but that's what that feels like as far as it's being attached to somebody. So, shit, I don't know where the fuck it come from, but somebody saw a sign like, it's you, motherfucker. Yeah, that was in the junk box reading. Uh, two, it's giving me that type of energy. And remember in the junk box reading, Gemini, if you watched it, the twins were split up. 
right? I didn't call out signs, but I know you peaked yourself because you just, we air signs, you smart, you know that. So you know you were, if you were you or them, you know what I mean, this the you versus them shit. Uh, here, like the junk box reading. I don't know what side you on, but if you fuck with me, you on the you side. You know what I mean? And it's like, I saw the signs and shit. Like, I'm fucking out of here. This is some bullshit. I'm about to get stuck here and let my shit burn up. That, that would be us, Gemini, okay? Somebody also burned a bridge with you, Gemini, or you burned a bridge with somebody. It could be with the water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or a fire sign. Like, this shit is over, G. Like, there's nothing else to talk about or nothing to fix or anything. Somebody can tell, too. Like, it's a whole fucking rap. Some of y'all are going to go on a date, Gemini, in August. This could be online or some shit like that or some, a blind date or someone you just meet and go out one night, okay? And you like, this motherfucker weird, G. That's what you going to say, Gemini. This negative energy, you see the signs. I don't know what, what they do, what they say. It's something that's a turn off, Gemini. You like, hell to the no, no. This is a disaster waiting to happen. This could be like your... uh. For some of y'all, Gemini, this is like an emergency text that you send someone, and not that you in danger or nothing, but say like you Ubered somewhere, right, to meet somebody at a restaurant, like on a date, and then when you meet them, you're like, oh, hell fucking no, and you text your homegirl like, this is an emergency operator, like, bitch, come pick me the fuck up, go to the bathroom and dip out on that motherfucker. Somebody get ghosted here, uh, Gemini. They text somebody like, come and get me. Like for real, Gemini, or they give a wink, the wink, wink, uh, something, or the sign of something. Like, come, we saw the security guard outside, G. Somebody call somebody, like, come get my motherfucking ass right now. Damn, somebody may lose their mind tonight, Gemini, or tomorrow, or the day after. I don't know. I don't know why they said it like that. Or, yeah, this could be a friend. Like some friend may be like connected to some old weird ass shit that you're not connected to. And you realize when you kick it with them, like, yeah, we'll never kick it again. You know, like, I'm going to kick it this one last time, but this motherfucker ain't never going to see me again. You know how it is, Gemini. You an air sign. That's why I'm kind of laughing because we be in our head like kicking it with people like, yeah, this is the last time this motherfucker going to ever see me. And you know it, Gemini. Like, you know this. Or cross watcher. Cancer, whoever this is, they know it too. Heavy fire, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Taurus, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or it's you. Someone knows, like, this is my last night here. This is my last day at this job. Something like that. Damn. Put something on the damn, what's the fire now? Yeah, friction is what I heard. Friction in the home, or there's friction here between people now. Yeah, some, it's been some people getting between you and someone, Gemini, or you've been getting between someone and someone else here, causing problems or some shit. And ever since that, or whoever's been doing it, somebody's been getting between someone, uh, coming together or relationship, and it's been causing friction or problems. This is a lot of energy here is what this is giving me. With these gazelle running and, and this, like here, it's like beef, you know? So friction. But somebody's not down with that shit. The stamp reverse, like I'm fucking cool on this shit. You know what I mean? Like, you cause problems. Not you, Gemini, but I'm saying whoever this is that's uh, recognizing the signs in this shit, they're saying this. So it could be you saying this. Or someone seeing this shit in your ass, like, hell to the no. Somebody's getting a scar removed. Or, like, a uh, laser, you know, like, something about a scar getting removed. Or you're just healing, Gemini, is what this means, too. Because this is the removal of a scar. Or, shit, somebody go off a cliff, G. Or it goes uh, overboard, over the edge or something, because we know what happened to Scar and Lion King, and then you got the stamp that's unstuck. He couldn't hold on, and he slipped. Oh, no, that wasn't Scar. That was Mufasa. Oh, that's fucked up. Not the good one. Oh, no, didn't Scar fall off, too? I know something happened to him in the end, but no, that was Mufasa. Or Mufasa got you. Whatever the fuck it is, it's some friction. It could be between brothers and sisters. This could be siblings and shit, Gemini. I don't know. Okay, because I done got the story all fucked up, but shit, even then when the Lion King came out, I was on some other shit then, okay? I wasn't in no motherfucking Lion King, even though we all saw the shit, but I have a feeling, Gemini, you was on some grown shit when the Lion King was out too. Like, you was probably babysitting and saw that shit, you know? So, excuse me if I get the old lions and shit all fucked up and everybody roll, okay? Anyway. Somebody doesn't want to stay in Africa as well. This is like, I don't want to be stuck in Africa, so, I mean, I don't know. Or shit, someone may be overseas or something like that, and they're stuck somewhere with your passport, Gemini. Be careful. Put one over here with the, with the fires. 
damn sure could be dealing with the fire sign or this has to deal with uh this has to do with the fire sign leo aries sagittarius the knight of wands heavy sagittarius yeah it's a lot of like i don't know y'all running around like wild animals or heathens this giving me like wild heathens i don't know if this your kids running in the house gemini's like what the hell <laughs> I don't know, Gemini. That shit made me laugh because I can hear them and shit. I know you like what the. I don't know if they upstairs or running up the stairs or what, G. But you like what the fuck is that? It sound like a, a herd of cattle. Yeah, them your kids, Jimmy. <laughs> Especially if you got little fire sign children and shit. They uh hyped in August, okay? Uh okay. But there's something about a lot of friction or like conflict that someone wants to avoid here, Gemini, for sure. Because this uh, Knight of Wands is going the other way. Like leaving this shit. They don't want to get stuck in this. Someone may not be uh, evolving, changing. You know what I mean? Like like upgrading or, you know, like just getting better. Whatever that means to you, Gemini. And because of that, uh, whoever's connected to this person, it's causing things to happen in that person's life. So it's like uh, someone's still a loser, right? When they, they don't even try to do anything better for themselves, they're just a loser. And someone hangs out with this loser, right? And then they wonder why they lose it. And it's like, it's this loser, mom. It's like, it's this shit, Jimmy. Somebody's like, I can't stay here. Uh, that's why we fighting this, all this friction and all this shit. Like, you don't do shit. Yeah. You may have reconciled with this person, Gemini. This is somebody I feel like that keeps uh, either you keep coming back to this person or this person keeps coming back to you. I don't know if it's family, friend, lover, but this is like happened more than once with this person causing problems. But I feel like they're getting in between like a relationship here because this looks pretty nice here. It's like bringing negativity into a relationship or a home or some connection or marriage and shit because you let somebody stay there. It's like letting your cousin come stay and shit. Like ever since they've been there, it's not funny, Gemini, but it's like it's been problems. Like, you know, you know what I mean? My kids fighting and shit. My wife, my husband mad at me and shit. My girl, my dude, you know, like you got to go. It's like somebody just wherever they go, they just cause fucking problems, G. Period. Look at you. Like, dear sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> Look, like, please get this motherfucker out of my house. Or somebody feels this way about someone they let move in with them. Uh, something like that, Gemini. Heavy Leo here. Heavy Sagittarius. Aries here. Uh, Taurus. Or Taurus Gemini Cusper. I don't really feel like it's the water sign. If you're a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, I feel like whoever this is, the heathens and shit, they're getting in between you and this Gemini, possibly. Uh, if you're a water sign watching or you have water, a lot of water in your chart, Gemini, or they're getting just between a connection. Like, you know what I mean? Like, uh, a lo uh, some love or some shit. Can I use everything? One, two, three. Okay, yeah. One more. Okay. Yeah. Somebody also just, like... Yeah, they started playing that. I just want to fuck you. No kissing and hugging, girl. You got a husband who loves you. It's like this. Like somebody just hit it and quit it. What the fuck? Gemini, somebody cold. This damn sure is scar out here. Somebody may have hurt somebody by like uh, treating them like a one night stand or just like a sexual thing here. Maybe that's what it is, Gemini. Something was like sexual here and like maybe two people got together real quick like over a lust thing and then once they moved in they realized they don't like each other motherfuckers is petty like it was just a you know like it could be something like that and now somebody wants somebody gone oh hey jimmy be careful letting people move in and all and hiring people real quick because they seem because it's like resume energy you know what i mean everybody put some bullshit i can type a million words a minute <laughs> says this person right it sound good till you hire them and give them a stack of shit and be like yeah i need you to type all that shit and they like think 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 enter 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 like you're like what the fuck happened to the million words a minute you know now now you're causing problems here i need you to speed it up is what this is somebody is not who somebody thought they were gemini or some shit like that okay this kind of falls in line with that uh bonus reading you had was that the bonus? Yeah, it was some crazy. I didn't know if you was watching TV, Gemini, yeah. Or if that was your real fucking life, G. But the way this looking, it should kind of is your real life. It's like drama. Here go the law, hire a fit, or the government, or somebody. I don't know what that's about. Something about, if some of y'all work at the house, you have a government job, you want to leave that shit. That shit messy as fuck. 
your boss messy, all the bitches or all the motherfuckers that work there messy. I feel like it's a couple of them that aren't messy, but they older women or older men that been there a long time and they keep to themselves. Then the only ones that ain't messy and don't uh, talk shit or do shit, but they on their way out to retirement. You on your way out just because you don't like this punk ass job. It's a government job, a state job, or it's a marriage. You know? This like, I like the kids better than everybody else in this family. <laughs> That's what this is, Jibadai. This like you hanging out in the kids' room all the time and you a motherfucking grown-up. And you like, they make more sense, nut. Damn. That's crazy. Like, y'all want to go play? <laughs> Look at you, Jibadai. You a grown-ass. This shit funny as fuck. But it's almost like, you know what I mean? Like, even the kids ain't that fucking petty and childish. You know what I mean? I'd rather kick it with them. Whoever, away from whoever this is. That shit crazy as hell. Oh, wow. Yeah, they keep saying this is resume energy for sure. Yeah, it is. It's like you got duped or somebody else got duped. Like they big themselves up that they could do something or they were something or I am something or whatever the fuck. And somebody believed them. But I feel like, well, let me see. Yeah, ain't no swords out here. So I don't know. It must have been some good sex. Because I'm like, I don't see no pinnacles. I was looking for some swords to see if you saw any proof or y'all had a conversation if it was paperwork, a document, right? Uh, any of that. No, it's just a wand and two cups here, okay? That's dick and two balls. So I don't know. Somebody's a whole dick out here too, uh, Gemini, okay? A Sagittarius, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Yeah, the water sign could be a whole dick. But I feel like they just an asshole. I don't feel like they're necess they could be an asshole because of this situation. Or you, Gemini. It's like this situation makes me act like a dick. You know what I mean? It's this negative energy. They act like a dick, so I'm a dick back, basically. And then someone's like, I don't want to be a dick. You know? They unstick themselves. Like, I'm no scar and no hyena. You know, that's not me, says someone, and they leave. Yeah, someone realizes they're changing into what it is they don't want to be, Gemini, okay, in August. What the hell? This shit is funny but sad and... Woo! Yeah, something about Africa, okay? Maybe somebody could be riding an elephant or something or someone could be on a safari or this could be the circus or this somebody house, G. Okay, because you know in the circus they, you know, or something, Excalibur is what I heard. So I don't know, somebody could be going to an amusement park. I mean, they making a lot of money off you motherfuckers this summer. I've been picking up on that shit a lot. But y'all got kids, and you like, you hear how they running through my house? Nah, we going to Excalibur, the water park, let them run all that shit out. Yeah, I see why y'all, I don't have kids, so that's why I was wondering. Like, damn, y'all amusement parking it up, but I see you trying to wear their ass out. Yeah, it don't stick. It stick for that day. You like, I hope they tire all weekend and don't ask me for shit. Talk about your kids. Nope. Uh, if y'all went to Disneyland on Friday, Saturday about 2.30, 3 o'clock, they're like, Mom, we going to the mall. <laughs> we going to the mall. We going to... I'm telling you, kids don't get tired, okay? If we talk about children, they ain't about to sit down or none of that shit. They just got energy to burn. It ain't necessarily negative, but they ain't cleaning up nothing and doing no chores. They just got energy to burn. They little friends want to come over, eat up all your food, spending all this shit. Some about your uh, children, Gemini, and they're being very inviting to other children coming to just... <laughs> That's fucked up, Gemini, but I feel like... You a cool ass parent though, whoever I'm talking to. I feel like you super cool like that, but I feel like you like tired. Look at you. Like these ain't even my motherfucking kids and shit. <laughs> Look at you. I don't know where the fuck they parents at. This is you saying, how come how come the kids can't go to the other parents' house? Why they always gotta come over here and shit? I don't know, Gemini. Your kid just be telling everybody, yeah, we got rice krispie treats, we got sunny D, and we got purple stuff. <laughs> Oh, shit. If that's not the case, Gemini, this is how somebody was bigging themselves up, G. Okay? It could be in a romantic situation. Somebody was like, I got the goodie, I got the this, I got the blah, I got the rap, 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 rap. Somebody was like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Right? And they get there and it was none of that shit. Or it is that shit, but it's like, it's a lot going on to get it. You know what I mean? You got to fight to get some Sunny D. <laughs> That's fucked up. This like somebody like always asking you, what are you getting out the fridge? What are you doing? What are you, you know what I mean? It's like this type of shit like, damn bitch, look at your face or whoever this is. Like, can a, can a nigga get some juice? Shit, I was going to the bathroom. Somebody getting police somewhere, Gemini too. 
If this ain't kids, I see why somebody leaving, G. Like, I can't do this shit. Because kids need to be policed and patrolled. They'll eat up everything. They'll use up all the toilet paper, all the cups, everything. So I get it. You know what I mean? Why you do that shit. But if this an adult, I see why they're leaving. But whoever this is didn't know it was going to be. Like, this could be a job where you thought, like, I'm an adult. I clock in, clock out. Like, why are you breathing down my neck? Like, this feel like a school or something. Like, I don't want to work here. Like, what kind of shit is this? But when you went on the interview, it didn't seem like that. You know what I mean? They made it out like, you know, they leave you alone. Let you do your job unless you fuck up. Unless I call you, we leave you alone. Just show up, do your job. No, it's like every day there's a meeting, there's a this, there's a that. And it's like, what kind of shit is this? Like, I, <laughs> it's like this, Gemini. This shit funny as hell. I'm sorry for laughing so hard, but damn. Put one on here. They just keep saying it's resume energy. So be aware, Gemini, if this ain't happy yet, you know? So this could be, if this is a kid situation, say your kid bring a little kid over and be like, hey, mommy, this is Timmy. Timmy wants to come over and play. And Timmy's like, nice to meet you, Mr. Gemini, Mrs. Gemini, right? Looking all nice and shit. And it's a little heathen, G. Little gang member and shit. Still, you know what I mean? It's like they put that little uh, Wally Cleaver, Beaver Cleaver shit on for you. And it's a, it's a little heathen and shit, okay? If that's not the case, then somebody got in a relationship with somebody like that. And it's like a whole hellhound, G, is what I heard. Okay, damn. Let me get up out of here, Gemini. Put one, because I'll be here laughing with y'all all damn night, and I got shit to do. Okay? Two pugs in a rug. I told you. Somebody is like, I'm out of here, though. Okay? Maybe somebody thought they were the pug in the rug. Maybe somebody's leaving somebody, because now it's like a lot of pugs in a rug and rabbits and shit. Somebody damn sure was fucking out here. Okay? Fucking like rabbits is what I heard. That's why two people got together is what this is or somebody out here fucking like rabbits okay uh is what this is somebody could be sleeping with somebody else and they're in a relationship gemini i don't know okay but i do know someone wants to unstick themselves somebody's out here having an affair gemini they want to unstick themselves from someone and just be permanently in a relationship with the person they're having an affair with is what i'm picking up on someone's not comfortable going back and forth i'm not picking that up someone's like this shit fucking up the shit that i want staying in some shit that i don't want to fuck with but i live here i got kids it could be a whole they could be married i don't know but somebody's like i'm about to leave this shit uh, ain't gonna get the shit that I want because it's fucking up the shit that I want. Yeah. Got duped by that resume energy, by that bird. Yeah, it was a bird. Ooh, wee, Jimmy. Let me go. Jimmy, now that's been your reading, G. I hope everything ended up all right, okay? Uh, like I said, it may or may not have resonated with every single Gemini. Still, thank you for visiting my channel. Am I tripping or not? Tarot. My name is Cockfrost, but you can call me the Ghetto Nun. Please hit like, subscribe, share with your fans. Again, info for private readings will be below the video. You can purchase your DU gear and your tune in deck at thegettonun.com. And I will talk to you later. Love you. Bye.